Welcome to Tabletop Baseball. Very, very excited today. It is game start number 35 of Ron Guidry's replay. This is it. He is 25 and 6. 25 and 3 at 25 and 3 in reality. And they're taking on the Red Sox. He gets the win in real life in this one to move to 25 and 3. He went six and a third, gave up six hits, two runs, one walk, five strikeouts, and did give up a home run. And Boston, or the Yankees won the game 5-4. And so Gidry improved to 25-3. and three. That was his final record. He can beat that in the win column. With a win here in the replay, it'll be 26-6. and six. And after a very, very rough start, you know, I didn't think there was any way he was going to get to 25 wins. Now he's looking to get 26 um, versus the Red Sox here. Mike Torres on the mound for the Red Sox. Yankees go Rivers in center, Munson catching, Pinella in right, Jackson DH, Nettles at third, Chambliss at first, White in left. Brian Doyle is going to get the start at second. Bucky Dent at short. For the Red Sox, it's going to go Burleson short, Remy at second, Rice and right, Yaz and left, Fisk catching, Lynn in center, Hobbs and DH, Scott at first, Brohammer at third. Mike Torres, like I said, on the mound. Here we go. Mickey Rivers, 3 1. It's a 4. Column 3, 44. Wow, this is a different looking card here. 44, 6, 22 to 66 makes it a 62. A 62 in column 3. So, and then a 3 4 off the pitcher's card is a 3, so 65 in column 3. Line single to center for Mickey Rivers. Leads off the game with a single. Here's Munson, 5 6 is a one and a five one is a two so a three in column five grounder to second so he's gonna be out at second it's a four six fielder's choice brings up Pinella six one a thirty one six three is a one thirty two column six pops it out pops up to third Two away, Reggie Jackson. Two three is a two, and then a two three is a three, so five is going to be a strikeout. Mike Torres strikes him out. Leadoff runner gets on, but nothing after that. Rick Burleson, one six, 45, one two is a one, so 46 struck him out. Jerry Remy, 3-6, 47, 3-2 is a 1, 48, column 3, ground out to first. Chambliss unassisted. Jim Rice, 5-6 is a 2, 5-1 is a 1, 3, column 5 is going to be a grounder to second. Top of two, Nettles, 3-6, 47, 3-1, 49, column three, and that's going to be a single. Opposite hand, lefty-righty matchup, single. Brings up Chambliss, 4-4, four, four. was a four, and 4-1 four, at first going to be a double play I do believe let's check first base first of all he's a three so a seven um, actually it's not gonna be a double play it's gonna be a ground out force out a second we well actually possible double play we gotta check the pivot man all right so 
Again, it was a 4-4 and a 4-1. First base. Um, first base. Pivot man is shortstop. So shortstop is Burleson. He's a one on defense. And we get a five. So it is going to be a fielder's choice. No double play. Fielder's choice. Brings up Roy White. 5-3. Five, 5-5 five, 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 five. is a 3, so an 8 in column 5 is a walk. First and second, Brian Doyle. So getting some playing time here. 31, and that, he's got a lot of 31s there in column 6. It's going to be a 31 and then a 6-4. 33, column 6. So he's going to pop it up. Second base, two away, Bucky Dent. Five six is two. Five two is a two. Four column fives and a rounder to short. Paul Yastrzemski looking to get a base on balls here. No, maybe not. Three six. Forty seven. And it's going to be an out. And a 3-4. So 48 column 3 is going to be a leaping catch by the second baseman. Line out to second. Fisk 4-1 is a 2 and a 4-1. Let's ground out to first. Chambliss. Fred Land, Freddie Land, 6-3, 31. 6 4, 33, strikeout. Top of three, top of the order for the Yankees. 3 2. Mickey Rivers is a 2 and a 3 2. Off Torres is a 2. So 4 column 3 is a fly to right. And we're in the third inning, not the fourth. Thought that looked a little funny. I'm the only one that uses wide out, by the way. So Thurman Munson, 5-6 is a 1. And a 5-6 is a 4. So 5 and column 5. Grounder to third. I'm the only one that makes mistakes, I guess. I don't know. Seems like. 2-3. Two, 2-3 three. Two, is a 2. And a 2-4 is a 4-6. Column 2 struck him out. Still no score. Bottom of 3. Butch Hobson. 2-6. 5. Raised 5. 42. Column 2. What do we got here? Five. Stays a five. And we have center field. Center field. It's going to be a tough play. Not going to get there. It's going to drop. He's a four in the range department, which is good, but it's going to drop in for a hit. Brings up George Scott. Four, four. Eleven. And a 4-4, shortstop, Dent is a 2-13, column 4. And what is he? He's a 54, ah, 64, error. E6. First and second with nobody out. Brohammer, 34, or 3-4. 3-4 is a 57. And a 3 one fifty-eight column three is going to be an out. My bad. It's going to be the rare play. It's going to be a dribble to the mound is what it's going to be. After all that, we're tired of the runner of his choice. Hobson's a three on second base. 
four, five, or six, he's out at third. Don't get him. So it's an infield single. For Brohammer. Everybody's safe. Burleson, 5-5, five, five, bases loaded, 6, 7, and column 5. Two balls on the batter with bases loaded. 2-2 two, two is an 11. 2-1 two, is a 1, 13, or 12. 12 in column 2 is a single. But, Gidry has that asterisk. 2-2 is an 11, 2-1. Gidry has the asterisk, and where is it? Any results 12 to 16 or a pop out to first with an asterisk. Big pop out there. Gets Burleson to pop it up. One out, bases still loaded, Jerry Remy. 1-3 is a 3, and a 1-4 is a 1 is going to be a strikeout. So Gidry getting back into things here. Brings up Jim Rice, though. He's not out of the woods. I think that was a three. Five, two. Five, two is a 27 and a five, three. 29, column five. It is a fly to center. So he gets out of the bases loaded jam. Scary situation there, but if he gets out of it, still no score. Reggie Jackson, 3 2, is a 2 and a 3 6. There's a 5, so 7 in column 3. Single to left. Lead off single, there's Nettles. 1 1 is a 10, 1 5 is a 3 13. Single up the middle. Runner with four or five speed goes two bases. Reggie goes to third. Nobody out. Chambliss. Six six is a nine. Can he get one out of here? Lefty. Sixty six. Lefty. Makes an eleven. And a six four is a thirteen. That is going to be out. A three run shot. For Chris Chambliss, I just want to look like the Red Sox were going to get some runs. They get nothing, and the Yankees come back and hit a three-run shot, and it's three-nothing. Two-run, two-one. Roy White, the batter, twenty-nine, two-three, thirty-two. Column two is a ground-out pitch to first. Brian Doyle, 5'5", 27, 5'5", 30, column 5. Fly to center. Two away, Bucky Dent, 2'4", 16, and a 2'5", 20. Column 2, 20, fly to right. Damage already done, though. Three runs. Bottom of four. So Gidry again has the lead. See if he can finish this out. Four fours and 18. Four five shortstop. Dent to 220. Column four. Grounder possibly out of first. It's going to be a bang bang play. They get him. Um. I can't remember who that was hit to now. Shortstop. Fisk. 1-1's one, a 10, 1-4. One, the 1's so on 11 is going to be a single. Single up the middle for Fisk. Freddie Land, lefty, lefty. 1-4. 4-1-5, one, four. Four, one, five, 5 strikeout. Tough day for Lynn, two Ks. 
Butch Hobson, 5-1, 4, 5-3, 2, 6, 6 in column, 5's a walk. Runner on first only is the two balls on the batter, so that's what we have here. 4-2, 11, 4 ones, first base, Chambliss, 13, column 4, with uh, two outs. Make sure there's no error. 62, no error. He's runs over and tags the bag for the out. Top of five, three nothing Yankees. Mickey Rivers, six one, sixteen, six five is a three nineteen. Column six, fly to right. Thurman Munson, one five is a two, and one five is going to be a strikeout. Lou Pinella, two three, two two two. Five column two strikeout. Nice inning for Torres. Bottom five, George Scott, five four, forty five, and a five four. Forty seven column five it is a fly to center. Brohammer, lefty lefty, one six, forty five, and a one six, forty six, strike out. Burleson, two four, sixteen, two one, one seventeen, column two, struck him out. Top of the sixth, Reggie, Reggie, four two. Two, four, one, it's gonna be a ground out to first. Nettles. Five, one is a four. Five, two. It's two, six, column five is gonna be a walk. Nettles reach base all three times. Two singles and a walk, score to run. Here's Chambliss, six, five, 31. Six, three is a one. 32, column six. Pop out to third, two away. Brings up Roy White, switch hitter, 3-5, 12. And a 3-6, is a 5-17, column three. Double to center field gap. Runners advance two bases. And possibly scores. You got nettles though. Check with third base coach. And he's a two. Center fielder. Freddie lands a four. So minus two. A nine. He will hold. So two outs. Brian Doyle, second and third runners. Three, four, 57. Gonna be the rare play and then a 3 2. So 59. Runners on second and third. Rare play. And we have two outs and an eight. Line drive towards second. Second baseman dives to knock it down. Fires the ball to first, but throws high. Roll one die against the first baseman's defensive rating. If it's higher, he pulls down the throw. First base is George Scott. He's a three. And of course it's not higher. It's not higher. He can't make the play. Batter safe. Infield single. Runners advance one base. So first and third with two outs. Bucky Dent. 
one one's a 25, one one's a 328, column one. Single off the glove of the pitcher. And maybe an error. This definitely scores white. Pitcher may throw wildly. Pitcher's error rating Torres 46. No error. First and second, two outs. Mickey Rivers 21 or 2 1. 47, 2 5, 51. Column 2, 51, the grounder to the mound. He'll make that play. Two runs though, five nothing Yankees. Bottom of six. Jerry Remy, six four is a sixty, and a six four. Sixty two column six. Double, double into the gap or into the corner for Remy. Brings up Rice. Three five is a thirty three. Three. Three fives a thirty and a three three is a one. Thirty one column three. Line to left. One out. Carly Jastrzemski. Four two. It's a five. And a four two. Second base. Calling the infield back. Ground out of first. Runner moves to third. Two outs. Carl Fisk. 6 3. 16. 6 2. There's a 1. 17 is going to be a strikeout. Gidry digs deep. Strikes out Fisk. Top of the seventh. Timeout. Bob Stanley will come on for the Red Sox. Here in the seventh, two six, three, raise three, thirty two, column two, thirty two is going to be a five, and left field. Yeah, as it's going to drop in there for a hit for Munson. Pinello one five is a five one six is a five, so a ten. It's going to be a pop out to first. Reggie Jackson, a 1 6, 45, 1 6, 50, column 1. Come back here to the pitcher. Pitcher's defensive rating is a 2. Of course, it's a 1. So it's not higher. Batter safe beats his relay to first. Um, so they get the force at second, but no double play. Nettles, two ones, a 43. It's interesting. Four and a two one is a four. 47 column two. 47 column two is going to be ground out too short. It was not very interesting. So, bottom of seven. Gidry's looking for win number 26. Fred Lynn, one five. He struck out twice. And he's going to strike out again. 3Ks for Freddie Lynn. Butch Hops and 1 4 is a 35, and a 1 1 is a 136, grounder to third. George Scott, 6 2 is a 9. 6 1 is a 110 single. Two out single. Here's Jack Brohammer. Two six. Two six is a four. And a thirty-one. 
It's going to make it a five, so that's going to it's going to drop because nobody isn't has a six. It has to be it has to be greater. So that's going to drop in for a single. And runners advance one base, two bases if their speed is higher than the outfielder's arm. Which we're looking at center field, Rivers. <laughs> Scott's a two, so. He will go one base. Two outs, first and second, Rick Burleson. 4-6 is a 1 and a 4-5 shortstop. And it's going to be a ground out to short. Top of the 8th inning. Bobby Stanley is going to come back out. 1-6, 45, and a 1-4. 49. Column one, 49 is a strikeout. Three six for Roy White's a 62 and a 3-4. Three, 3-4 four. Three, four is a 4. 66, column three. Line drive single to center. Roy White brings up Brian Doyle, 6'3", 31, and a 6'6", 34, column 6, he's going to pop it up to center, fly out to center. Bucky Dent, 3'6", 42, and that's going to be an out, line out to second, or actually probably Probably short, actually short, since he's a righty. So nothing for the Yankees in the eighth. Still five nothing Yankees. Bottom of the eighth inning, Jerry Remy, five four twenty seven, and a five four twenty nine. Column five twenty nine is a fly to center. Rice, 3-3, three, three, 70. That's going to be a hit. 3-3 three, three is a 70 and a 3-5, one, so 71. No, it's not a hit. It's a pop out to first. For Jerry Rice, or J Jerry Rice, Jim Rice, 68 to 71, the pop out to first. Kidry having that one there cause that. 3-5 for Yastrzemski is a 3. 3-1 three is a 1. 4, column 3. Fly right. We'll go to the ninth inning. It's 5 nothing Yankees. And the Red Sox will go to their bullpen. Timeout. It's going to be Andy Hassler coming on for the Red Sox. Lefty. 3 2 is a 2, 3 5. 4 6, column 3 is fly to center. Thurman Munson, 2 2 is an 11. 2 2. 3 14, column 2, single to center. Lou Pinella, 6'5", 31, 6'6", 32, column 6, pop to third. 3 pop-ups and 2 strikeouts for Pinella. Reggie Jackson, 2'1", 38, 2'4", 3, so 41, column 2. It's a ground out, too short. Last call for the Red Sox, down 5-zip. 
Carlton Fisk leading off. 1 5. Has a 4 and a 1 3. He's going to be a strikeout. Freddie Lanny struck out. He's going to get pinch hit for a timeout. Frank Duffy will come on and pinch hit for Freddie Lynn. 2-2. Two 2-2 -two. Two is an 11 and a 2-6 is a 1-12. Column 2. Oh, we got the 2-6, didn't he? There's no asterisk there on the on Gidry's card on his 2-6. So he will single. Instead of popping up, it's a single. For Frank Duffy. Butch Hobson, two fives, a 16, two twos, a one, 17, column two. 17, column two, they pop out or fly out to center with men on base. Brings up George Scott down to their last out, four three. Four three is a one, and that's going to be it. Four six. It's a ground out to second. Ball game over. It's a shutout to end the Ron Guidry replay. I didn't put a zero for the Yankees. And a zero for the Red Sox. And five zip. Guidry goes nine, gets the W. Hits. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven hits. Zippo. No home runs. Walks and strikeouts. Walks, he had. Looks like zero walks. Strikeouts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9Ks, nine strikeouts, so finishing out in style with 9Ks and no walks. And I'm going to come back with the totals here. I'll total all this out and see what he ends up with. So we'll take a little time out and I'll come back. All right, so here are the totals in the replay. 289 innings pitched, in actuality 273.2. As card says, 274, but it's actually 273.2. I don't know if they just rounded up or what. Um, hits 224 in the replay, 187 in actuality. Earned runs 75 in the replay, 53 in reality. So 22 more earned runs. He had a rough start. A lot of this, you know, was from that rough start that he had. And then he had some rough starts in reality, you know, where he only went a couple innings, one inning, whatever, and he didn't have that in the replay. So his innings got boosted up there. And, of course, in, even in the beginning, I left him in a little longer than probably they would have. Uh, strikeouts or walks 84 72 in reality strikeouts 273 to 248 and again the innings pitched and you know all that corresponds to this stuff 22 home runs and of course the 22 home runs is going to you know increase the earned runs because he's got almost he's got nine more home runs given up in the replay. And so you figure that's at least nine runs. Um, I'd say probably half of those had a man on base, you figure at least. So you're looking at 13, 14 more runs and 22, so that drops that down to about eight. Eight-ish in there. So it makes it a little closer gap there. ERA 234, ERA 174 in reality. 25 and 3 in reality. 26 and 6, so he gets the 26th 
wins one more than he actually had but three more losses than in actuality and again like I said that rough start was where those some of those losses came in I didn't think there was any way he was gonna get even 25 wins because I, I think at one point in the beginning he was like I don't know five and three or something something along those lines not looking too good so but writes the ship becomes Ron Guidry of real life and starts dominating especially in these last few games I mean the the Yankees gave him run, run support big time he had I don't know I need to figure out how many shutouts he had um, he had quite a few and complete games and shutouts and stuff like that maybe I'll do that and come back alright so the complete game shutouts he in, in the replay he had 20 complete games 8 shutouts in actuality he had 16 complete games 9 shutouts so pretty good there all in all replay is a great game a little bit fiddly sometimes with the the numbers it's real easy to get those numbers crossed up, which I'm sure I probably did a few times, but that's going to happen. You know, you're going to make mistakes. This is a game that's real easy to do that with the, you know, the three, the cross-referencing of numbers and all that. But uh, other than that, it looks like a great game, and that's going to do it for the Ron Guidry replay. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. And that's going to do it. Thank you guys for watching and supporting the channel, hitting that like button, and subscribing. Till next time, you guys have a great evening. Take care. God bless.